Yo, what is up, guys? My name is Nicholas Earl, and welcome back to another episode of Earl Sports Bets. And today we have another free pick video. This for a little Labor Day action in the CFL. The later game here, it's a six o'clock game. We have a double header tomorrow, two o'clock Toronto Hamilton, six o'clock the Battle of Alberta, Calgary, and Edmonton, the Stampeders, three point favorites in this game, total 52 and a half. Trey Ford will dress in this game. However, McLeod Bethel Thompson will continue to start for those Edmonton Elks. On the flip side, with the Calgary Stampeders coming in off of a bye in this game there, where they lost on that last second field goal, 31-29 to against Ottawa, the last time we saw them on August 15th. And when we look at this matchup here, we have a Calgary team that defensively is starting to struggle as of late. 31-39, 23-33, 24-41, 30 points in their last six, uh, seven games. They're giving up a lot of points. And on the flip side, they're able to put up some points. This is a team that has been playing to the over as of late three straight overs they put up they put up 29 against ottawa 25 against uh toronto and 27 against toronto on the flip side we all know uh that the edmonton elks have been an over team this year primarily it's six and five to the over which is kind of surprising that's just because of the beginning of the season they kind of struggled to score but they gave up a lot of points uh but they have one of the best offenses in in the cfl these this edmonton elks team granted they only put up 17 last week, but that was in Montreal against a really good Alouettes defense. Previous to that, 47, 33, 42, 28, 14, 34, 21, 36. So this is a team that's able to put up points. Their defense has been better as of late, 21, 22, 16, but previous to that, 31, 44. So this team definitely has the, the ability to give up points here in this game. And I lean Edmonton team total in this game. I think I might get involved with the team total in this game for the Edmonton Elks. Um, I don't trust them to cover the number, though. I, I, this is one where I would prefer rather just letting them just score me points rather than having to rely on what this defense could or will or will not do. And I and we know this Edmonton Elks team, they have not had that much difficulty putting up points this year, but giving up points has been their problem. I think they do give up their fair share of points in this game, but I can also see this Elks offense putting up 31 in this spot as well. So I like this game to go over 52 and a half Elks Stampeders over 52 and a half for a little Labor Day action here. If this information was helpful to you guys at all, feel free to hit that thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel if you guys have not already, and turn on those post notifications so you guys are notified each and every time we come out with the video here at Earl Sports Bets, or we go live, which is every single morning anywhere between 10 and 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time for the Earl Sports Bets show. That's going to do it for this one. Well, thank you as always for watching.